Marcus, welcome to AFC Bournemouth. How happy are you to be here? Yeah, I'm really happy to, to be here. Uh, it's a dream come true to, to play in the Premier League and this club wants me and yeah, I'm really happy to be here today. Just tell us about what the last few days have been like for you in terms of coming over and signing for the club. Actually, it was pretty fast, we uh, fra fast week. Uh, yeah, everything goes really fast and yeah, today I'm here, Just I just signed my contract and yeah, I'm really excited to, to meet also the team now. On Saturday, we got off to a really good start with a 2-0 win against Aston Villa. Were you able to keep an eye on that one? I couldn't because I, I had my last training there in Feyenoord, um, but w because we turned in the afternoon, uh, I, yeah, the, the guy from the staff was telling me how was the, the result and everything was like, yeah, I was w expecting the, the result. You're now in England. How much are you looking forward to playing in the Premier League? Yeah, it's a dream. Also, since I was young, I, I want to play in the, one of the best leagues and this one is, I think, is one of the best ones and, and I like to, to be here. You've played in the Argentinian league, the Eredivisie. What do you think you've learned from playing in those leagues that you can bring here at AFC Bournemouth? Yeah, I think I will try to, to do my best, work hard and try to, to, go, to give the, my best to, to the team. And what are your first impressions of the stadium and the training ground and all the facilities here? Yeah, I, I really like the, the facilities here. I think our, our nice ones are, are like, the, they have everything. So that's, that's good to, to develop and yeah, keep on growing up as a player. Your nickname is The Gladiator, I believe. Just tell us a little bit about where that's come from. Actually, that come from by, by my father. He, Always after the games, yeah, come on, gladiator, uh, you're doing well, blah blah blah, and yeah, they they took it. The fans uh, take it, and yeah, they start to to call me like that. How big an influence have your parents been for your career? They're here with you today, signing for the club. They they're clearly very important to you in your career. Yeah, I'm a really family guy, so I like to to have my people around. So yeah, they are always there to support me in the in the good and the in the bad moments. So yeah, they are really important for me. Now you're known for your defending, but in 2020 2021 season, you won the goal of the season in the Eredivisie. Tell us about that. Yeah, it was uh, an amazing goal. Actually, uh, I was yeah, I was on the box, and the first time I I, I saw the ball in the in the air, I, the first thing in my mind was okay, do the bicycle. Yeah, then was a beautiful goal, and I got the that uh, award, and yeah, I'm really happy with that. And just tell us for those supporters who haven't seen you play before, just tell us a little bit more about your game and and all the strengths that come with it. Uh, I'm kind of player who really likes to, to have the ball, to play good football, uh, also a hard worker. Uh, I really like to, to help the team and yeah, give everything for the team. Now you made your debut for Argentina back in June. That must have been a, a really proud moment for you. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, it's a dream to be to be in Argentinian uh, squad. It's something that you you want since you are young and. Yeah, achieved that was an amazing close of the last season. Now you're here at AFC Bournemouth, there's that World Cup in November. Have you set yourself any targets for the season ahead? Now we're right at the start of it. Yeah, first of all, uh, I really want to, to start to play in the Premier League, to be here in Barmond, I think is amazing. And then let's see if uh, I, can, I can be in the, in the World Cup also, it's one of the, other, of the targets of this half of, half of the year. Well, Marcus, we're really looking forward to seeing you here at Vitality Stadium and welcome to the club. Yeah, thank you very much.